For the past 365 days, BoobTube has been recording everything that you say on the bus. The following is a highlight reel, handpicked by artisanal eavesdroppers, brought to you by the Wellesley Tea Society. I want to be his friend, and either way, cute people stick together so he can, like, hook a sister up. I'd rather ride the Peter than ride him. I always feel like a trashy suburban mom. I put a bra on for this. I mean, I don't mind getting his number for platonic purposes. Does that make sense? I have a frozen chicken sandwich in my purse. We don't touch two things in life, rabbit dogs and coked up penises. I don't party, I network. Sneezing is like pooping, but for your face. I'm fine. <laughs> Pre-recorded from Wellesley College, you're watching BoobTube. Welcome to Wellesley College Television's BoobTube. I'm Tara Gupta. And I'm Delina Keen Lee. Breaking news, President Kim Bottomley is set to step down for the following year. No, K-Bot, don't go. It's the end of the semester, and you know what that means. Department parties! If you're into stale wine and avoiding eye contact with your thesis advisor, this is your moment. Students presented their hard work at this year's Roman conference to all three attendees. The Shakespeare Society recently wrapped up their production of Hamlet. It was incredible, full of angst and ghosts, much like our campus. And now, a word from our sponsor. Hi everybody, I'm Dean O'Keefe, and I'm here to talk today about a very special time of year that's coming up, finals period. We are all dedicated to reducing stress levels for students during this very difficult time of the year. Now we have all kinds of strategies for that. We have crayons and drawings, we have hot chocolate, we have yoga and meditation here in the library. We have all kinds of strategies to help students manage the stress and suffering that goes with finals. In the past, you know, last couple of semesters we've had a program of therapy dogs. This semester we have a new program of therapy boys. We are importing boys from all over the Boston area to bring a fresh perspective to Wellesley. Hanging out with a therapy boy is guaranteed to improve your grade point average. And good news, you can check out a therapy boy from the library for up to 12 hours. All you need is your one card. Hey, don't forget to bring him back. Make this the best finals period ever. Brought to you by the Clapp Library. The trailer for the upcoming animated movie, The Little Prince, has been released. Prince is suing for copyright infringement claiming that Little Prince was the original title for his 1980s sex tape. The long-awaited Apple Watch is finally here. The ants are very excited about their new big screen TVs. Earlier this month, Vice President Joe Biden stole the pacifier from Mayor Bloomberg's grandchild, and we thought Obama was the one with the oral fixation. Police recently arrested a man for allegedly smashing his roommate with a beer bottle in an iPhone versus Android argument. Witness reports say he was, for once, grateful he had Boost Mobile. And now, a tribute to those who we will lose in the year to come. From the class that brought you four glorious years of boot, comes a whole new, completely original story about mystery. music. So long, farewell, our readers and goodbye. Aliens. I'll be right here and letting go. Oh, I will let go. But I promise. Does that answer your question? Sincerely, the class of 2015. The California Senate Education Committee recently passed a mandatory vaccination bill after a measles outbreak. In the event of the bill passing, Jenny McCarthy reports she will officially secede from California and develop her own city-state of vaccination-free ex-soap opera stars. A Fox News host recently speculated that Democratic presidential hopeful Hillary Clinton stopped by a Chipotle's to reach out to Hispanic voters. Hillary denies this accusation, saying, I did not have intimate relations with that burrito. During a committee hearing, Colorado Senator Cory Gardner made a joke about cherry blossoms, saying, we've got some buds in Colorado, too. 
Really, Gardner? I had no idea there was pot in Colorado. Michelle Bachman says Obama's policies on Iran's nuclear program and marriage equality have caused the rapture. Obama responds, you're not the only Michelle to tell me I've caused a rapture. Thanks for joining us here on BoobTube. Make sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram, and most importantly, endorse us on LinkedIn. Stay perky. Oh, <laughs>